as Pope Francis officially proclaimed the Catholic Church's Jubilee Year 2025. Thoughts and discussions on the four major papal basilicas in Rome have surfaced again, as these basilicas belong to the first category of jubilee places to obtain jubilee indulgences. In jubilee years, the holy doors of these basilicas are solemnly opened. The four major papal basilicas are St. Peter's Basilica, St. John Lateran Arch Basilica, St. Mary Major Basilica, and St. Paul's Outside the Walls Basilica. St. Peter's Basilica, the world's largest church, was originally built by Emperor Constantine in the 4th century. In the early 16th century, it was demolished by Pope Julius II, who constructed the magnificent basilica we see today, which took 120 years to complete. Its facade was constructed from stones collected from the Colosseum. Legendary artists like Michelangelo, Bramante, and Bernini contributed to this architectural marvel. St. John Lateran is the oldest and most highly ranked basilica in Rome. This is called Arch Basilica because it is the Cathedral of the Diocese of Rome. After constructing the basilica in the early 4th century, Emperor Constantine gifted the Lateran Palace to the popes as their official residence. It remained so until the seat of the Holy See was shifted to the Vatican in the 14th century after the Great Schism. Maria Maggiore or St. Mary Major Basilica was built in the 5th century by Pope Sixtus III following the Church's official proclamation that Mary was the Mother of God. Situated on the summit of the Esquiline Hill, this basilica is the largest Catholic Marian church in Rome. The 246-foot high bell tower of this basilica is the tallest in the city of Rome. Basilica of St. Paul outside the walls was also founded by Emperor Constantine in the 4th century. It is situated outside the city walls on the site of St. Paul's tomb. A larger basilica was built on the site in 390, which was the largest basilica in Rome at that time. Although it was destroyed in a fire in 1823, a reconstructed basilica, which we see today, was consecrated by Pope Pius IX in 1859. These magnificent basilicas stand not only as architectural marvels, but also as the symbol of pride and tradition for the entire Catholic Church, with their holy doors opened wide for the faithful to receive abundant graces.